Communications Minister Maxi Cuffey says a revived Trinidad and Tobago television will serve as a hub for local content development. Minister Cuffey held a news conference today to provide further details to the media about government's plan to wound up the Caribbean New Media Group. The minister met yesterday with employees of CNMG to discuss the plans. Peter Christopher has more. 12 hours, but Minister of Communications Max Cuffey held a press conference to provide further details concerning the closure of CNMG and the re-establishment of Trinidad and Tobago Television. He said the announcement to return to the TTT brand was generally well received, but he could not immediately say when the transition or the return to TTT would be completed. He also said while workers of CNMG could be rehired at the new TTT, so too could be members of other media houses. There is um, a, a compelling situation where employees will be rehired by TTT. Those employees can come from CMG. They can come from other media houses, including JSL, including the Guardian, um, Guardian Media, um, the CCN Group, which have all gone through similar exercises. The minister stressed that the new TTT would have a local content bias and was not meant to be a commercial entity, but rather an avenue for the local film industry. You have a show that you want to air to determine the, where, where the audience will, will go. You go to TTT, you offer them at whatever time sub, you, you develop an audience, um, you earn some revenue, after which the audience could grow strong. You offer the show to, C to CNC3 or to um, TV6. And that way, we build an industry. The minister said the new TTT would have an independent newsroom, but it was not expected to compete with privately owned stations TV6 and CNC3 in terms of news coverage but instead would focus on more news-related features. Peter Christopher, C News. Film Co., the filmmakers collaborative of Trinidad and Tobago, has welcomed today's announcement that a new public service broadcaster, TTT, is to be formed. And Film Co. has called for partnership between stakeholders and the government in the transition from CNMG to TTT in creating a public service broadcasting model that is unique to Trinidad and Tobago. It says the new TTT must be mandated to reflect and promote the spirit and sense of multicultural richness and history of Trinidad and Tobago. And Film Co. says investment in public television will boost a sense of national identity and pride, create intellectual and creative capital and social awareness. Film Co. says it is fully supportive of a national station that schedules local and regional programming and states further the combined audiovisual archives of TTT, GISL and CNMG must be seen as a financial and historical asset with dedicated librarians to catalogue, digitize and license the material. Former Minister of Communications Vasant Barth has weighed in on the government's decision to shut down state-owned Caribbean and New Media Group and revive the Trinidad and Tobago television station, saying the change must benefit the citizens of Trinidad and Tobago. Speaking with C News, Mr. Barrett said the name change will only be effective if proper goals are set. That a, a, name, a, a change of name is going to have a change of fortunes uh, for the company and for the organization. Uh, what it comes down to is proper management with a vision for the future in terms of what the station uh, needs to be um, as a product to the end user. What would make it attractive for people to switch on to uh, a government tele television run station. He also shared his thoughts on how state media should be run. I think state media needs to um, have a balance uh, between um, what government policy is, obviously, what the future, what they plan for the future of the country. Um, it has to be nationalistic, or some programming has to be nationalistic in outlook. Um, but I think there has to be a commercial um, part of it that 
um, where, where, where content that is attractive outside of what I've just mentioned that will lure people to want to come and look at it.